sometimes confused with a pinecone with legs, or an artichoke with a long tail, the pangolin is surely a unique looking mammal. They are sometimes called scaly anteaters, but they aren't related to anteaters in any way. Instead of having hair or quills, the pangolin has overlapping scales that feel a bit like our fingernails. The scales are made of keratin, just like our fingernails. They grow at the base and wear down at the tip, as the pangolin brushes up against branches and tree trunks. If you enjoy this content, and would like to see more, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. They are found in diverse habitats in both Asia and Africa in countries like Nigeria, Cameroon, India, Nepal, Taiwan, and of course, China. Some species are arboreal, so they spend most of their time sleeping, and hunting and living in trees. Their sharp claws and large, flexible tail allow them to keep a grip on vertical surfaces while using their front claws to break into insect nests. Other species are primarily terrestrial, which means they stick to the ground and typically dwell in burrows. All species are able to navigate water with some skill, although they are not known to frequent aquatic environments. Much like anteaters, these scaly creatures are exclusive insectivores that typically seek prey that dwells in hives or large nests. What they lack in acuity of vision, they make up for with an extremely strong sense of smell. Their keen nostrils help them seek out prey and pinpoint their location beneath soil or under tree bark. Ants and termites are prime targets due to their centralized nest structure and plentiful populations. Larvae of various insects also serve as a potential source of food, particularly for arboreal pangolin species. Their long, flexible tongue and sticky saliva are perfect for capturing small insects in their nests or along rugged surfaces. Since the pangolin has no teeth, it swallows the ants and termites whole. Its muscular stomach grinds the insects, along with the sand and small stones the animal swallows during the meal. A female pangolin spends 3 to 4 hours each night looking for food, and a male may forage for up to 10 hours. Humans are by far the most significant threat to pangolin populations across the world. The animals have long been hunted as a source of food, but their scales are also highly prized in some cultures as an ingredient in traditional medicine. As the most trafficked mammal in the world, all pangolin species face some risk of extinction. While human poaching and hunting is the primary concern when it comes to population management, there are natural predators throughout the pangolin's native range as well. Any large local predator is a potential threat, including hyenas, lions, and pythons. Conservationists don't have a clear idea of total pangolin population numbers in Asia and Africa, but there is plenty of reason to believe that they are in sharp decline. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you found it interesting. Check out this next video on the strongest animals on earth. Have a great day and stay tuned for more videos on wildlife.